Hello and welcome. Two days ago, I bought this Huffy Cranbrook from Walmart for $88. I think I got a good deal. It's your basic cruiser style bike, single speed, coaster brakes. Look at that gigantic handlebar. You're not going to ever miss a turn with that. Street tires, which I hear but do not know personally, can make a nice skid. <clears throat> anyway, uh, comfort pedals. The chain guard and the fenders are metal. And everything has a nice matte finish. Again, the springy seat. Um, it's got a perfect fit frame, we'll see. The welds, which seem to be the case for all Cranbrooks, are a bit sloppy. Except on this one's head tubes. Those are pretty good. Standard warning. Wear a helmet. Check your brakes. Don't ride at night. Why not? Oh, and eat your vegetables. Again, another look from the driver's point of view of those big old handlebars. I bought this with an eye towards making my own clunker bike after seeing a documentary. Here's everything that I stripped off the bike. The two tires. The chain guard front and rear fenders, that ridiculously large handlebar, and a rather long quill stem. I'll save these because I also do outreach repairs for bikes. And here's the finished product. Basically, a bike with all you need. Uh, the stem has a little higher reach than the original. It's a little bit shorter. Uh, the handlebar and the quill stem and the seat all came from my hyper spin fit when I upgraded it. Those grips came off my XR Pro. I've got these tiny knob mountain bike tires. They are Bell brand and they were only 20 bucks a piece so I figured I'd give them a shot. After all this is a budget build and I really can't <laughs> wait until I get a chance to try this on some gravel roads. Now if you enjoyed this video, and I hope you did, oh and there we go, there's the Bell logo. Uh, anyway, if you enjoyed this, and I hope you do, check out the link in the lower left for another cruiser style bike which I recently picked up. And there's another link to the lower right for one of my other videos. Thanks for watching. I always appreciate it when you do. Goodbye.